fuck. Oh, shit. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Scab Valley Roleplay. Mickey Sticky Flowers here. They just put a new fuck gas station over here, man. Fuck. Shit. Fuck. Muscle spasm. Yeah, shit. Let's fill her up. Make sure she's locked. Need to serve right his nozzle. Come on, fill that by the way. Fuck. There we go. I mean, look at this. They got a 24 7 over here. Let's go out and buy me some food. Okay. Buy me a pack of six. Yeah, I, I want a pack of redwoods, man. Alright. It's gonna be five bucks. Damn, they get their expensive. Just one pack of them. Remember when they used to be like two something? Alright, here you go. Back. Hey, let's go check out this fucking little mechanic shop. This shit. Fucking crazy. Someone's fucking running, man. Good thing it's not me. I'm not running. Back. Go check this place out, man. Slack her right up. Hey, shit, this place looks nice. Oh. It's a more automator. That's nice. Is this like a motorcycle place? Oh, that thing looks beautiful. Can I steal it? I can't steal it. I would have stole that if, I, if the keys were in there. I would have took straight off of that thing. But, but yeah, they got the men's and women's bathroom. Is this like a, just a bike place? Oh shit. I know when I'm supposed to walk in this one, but it's. Oh shit. Over here, uh, more bathrooms. It looks like, and there's an upstairs. What's over here? Does this these do these doors work? Mean? Oh shit! Oh, it's like a mechanic shop. Oh shit! This place is nice. Oh fuck. Yeah, I was still know where they're getting all this fucking tax money to build all this shit, man. The fuck? Yeah, it's nice. Got like offices up here. Yeah, oh, shit. Oh, you got a foosball table. No way. Oh, I remember when me and Dickie used to play this back in the day when we had one in one of the houses I used to own. Oh, shit. That was back like in the 70s, man. Uh, it goes way back. Now there's a door here. Can we go through these doors? Oh, and it takes you to the upstairs of this uh, mechanic place. That's yeah, pretty cool. And there's only one way to get up there, and that's through the. Ah, uh, it's pretty cool. Yeah, it's a nice place. I still don't know where I get this fucking tax money from. Fucking pigs. Fucking just hassling and trumping up people with charges, getting those fucking quotas. We're getting all that fucking free tax money for this fucking city. It's fucking bullshit. Fuck! Tomorrow for sure. Yeah. I'm just gonna fucking cook me some food. So let's now start cooking. Start cooking. Yep. Uh, gonna make me some of those THC sandwiches, man. That dicky if we could put on the menu. That shit's fucking delicious. Uh, yeah, this stuff's good.
Only thing I'm missing though is the liquid THC, but you know, I eat a sandwich, I fucking smoke later, you know. It's kinda the same. It's kinda the same, you know. Hey shit. Oh fuck, that's a cap. Hey shit. Let's flip that over. I don't want to burn that side. Hello, sir. Hey, hey, what's going on, man? How's it going? You mind stepping out of the vehicle? Oh, uh, yeah, sure. One second, man. Appreciate it. Hey, man. Hey, Just wanted to on? ask you. Good, good, good. I'm Lieutenant Roger Sandres Police State Police, and here to my right is Lieutenant Bullet, as well with Sandres State Police. The uh, reason we're here is someone actually called that you're kind of pulled off to the side like this, and... They just, oh, yeah. kinda, they didn't know what you were doing. They were worried. Oh yeah, I pulled up to the side. I'm, I'm cooking me some lunch, man. Cooking lunch? What are you? What are you cooking? A grill. You don't mind me asking. I'm, I'm cooking one of those sandwiches that my brother came up at my bar, Mickey's Groovy Hangout at two nine six. It's called the THC Sub. All right. Well, um, I mean, really, not much I'm gonna do. Not charging you with anything, just just kind of came out to see what you're doing, all right? Oh, all right, man. Dude, I'm just cooking. I wonder who called at me. Yeah, I'm not sure, uh, but they were just concerned that you were doing something you weren't supposed to, so that's the reason we're here. No, uh, I mean, understandable, I guess. I got called last time by some guys down in Polito. I was cooking, and apparently locals called me in saying that I couldn't be parking there, and the cops came. It was a big old deal. I'm just, this is my home now. So I'm like, I'm not getting the ticket or nothing. I'm free to go, right? So, uh, so you, sorry, I didn't really catch it, but you said you're cooking what again? I'm cooking, uh, THT subs that we set at my bar. It's called the, the, the Hippie Club Sandwich. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Um, give us one second. Uh, we're gonna go check some things out, and then, uh, we'll get out of your hair. All right. Alrighty, just stay here for me. Technically, the THC sandwiches would have some weed in there. Technically. I don't know what happened to this cop, why he's mute. Maybe he's doing something on the radio. I have no idea. have no idea. But I don't even know who was the init. Like, yeah, oh, shit. Here comes, here comes Gap. Alrighty, so quick question. Yeah, what's going on, man? You said that they were THC infused sandwiches, correct? No, I didn't say they were infused. It's that's the name my brother came up with because like people like to hassle us and call us hippies. I mean, yeah, granted, I am a hippie, but I mean, he came up with a sandwich called the the, the hippie THC. So the the T is the, and then the H is hippie, and then the C is a uh, club, and then he put an S at the end. So it's THC apostrophe S technically. So, the hippie club sandwich. I see. Gotcha. Okay. Alright, that's creative. Yeah, that was. I didn't even think of that. And he put it on the menu and he was like, this is a new idea. I'm like, wow, that's pretty smart. And I, I'm like, I smoke weed at a time, but I mean, not today I haven't. But, I mean, I'm someone that used to smoke and partake and all that. And then he can, I'm like, that's smart. I didn't even think of that, man. Oh, uh, yeah. Wow. Well. Alright, so All right, well. there's nothing in there? No, no, there's nothing in here, man. Alrighty, I was just wondering. Um, well, if you're, uh, you're not doing anything bad out here, I guess we'll, uh, go ahead and get out of your hair here. Alrighty, yeah, I'm just making me some food, man. I just got hungry, so I pulled over. This is my home now. Gotcha. Alrighty. Uh, actually, 
go ahead and give me one more second. Uh, I'm gonna go check a few more things out. You know, just make sure that you know this isn't private property, or uh, you can actually park here. So, we are right back with you. All right, hang tight real quick. Hey. <laughs> yeah, I think that one cop was fucking munching on something from his car and he just hasn't swelled it yet because it sounded like he was fucking talking. Like, she went while he's talking. I should have said something. Alright, sir. Oh, what's going on, so, man? I am getting a little hint. Of smelling, I'm smelling a little hint of marijuana. Alright. And I'm not gonna. Okay. So let me tell you this here, okay? Honesty goes a long way, and I just want you to be honest with me. Alright? So if you have any on you, or whatever you may be cooking, if it involves that, just. All I'm saying is I want you to be honest with me, alright? I'm giving you one shot to be honest, okay? Yeah, right. Well, I mean, I do got like a quarter on me, but I haven't smoked it all day today. Okay. I, I was told not to smoke and drive anymore. I went to jail for that last time. Yeah, that's a that's a big no no. Yeah, so I mean, this is my home, so technically I'm allowed to carry it on me because this is my home. I was told I can carry up to an ounce, but I just know not to. Yes, you can. I was just told not to smoke it ever again unless this is going to be my final stop for tonight, and I'm not driving nowhere. Right. right. So yeah, that's okay if you are you know if you want to do that, that's on you. Um, like you said, yep, you just cannot do it and then go out driving. I right. uh, no, I'm not gonna do that and drive because that that King officer man, he 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 was real harsh on me, man. Oh, I'm sorry, you had a bad a bad appearance with him. I mean, uh, he's a cool guy, wait not It just he he had to put the whole book on me and everything, man. Yeah, well, at the end of the day, we're just doing our jobs. I understand. All right, well, I got nothing further for you, right? Just make sure, like I said, if you're doing that, don't go anywhere, okay? I uh, no, no, I won't. Alright, well, you have a good rest of your day, alright, sir? Alright, you too, man. A few moments later. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, I forgot this is the fucking shit that's fucking laced. Ah, uh, no, it wasn't. Oh, I grabbed the wrong bag. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, now I've seen colors like I was on Christmas, Christmas Eve, and then the day before Christmas Eve, and whatnot. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Yeah, shit. You gotta keep it steady, man. You gotta keep it steady. Eventually. Jesus, what the fuck? Ah, shit. Fuck. I just got hit, man. Alrighty, by uh, what vehicle? It was uh, like a white two or four door. Two white. or four door? Yeah, it was either a two door or four door. I know it was a white car. Yeah, he just you went... got a plate, possibly? No, he just he he just took off. He just you guys just missed him. He fucking tried passing me and he sideswiped me and made me hit this tree. All right. Well, so just a white two or four door. That's all you got. Yeah. You possibly I, see who was in it. I only I only seen one person in there, as far as I saw. All right. Do you have a possible description? I know it looked like a male. 
man. All right. It was going too quick, and he sideswiped me, and he fucking sped off after he did it, and I just went sliding into this pole. First, I hit that tree, and then after hitting the tree, I slid over here, man. Alright, well, um, well, as far as I know, that's all we can do for you, and, uh, we'll be on the lookout for that vehicle, alright? Alright. Alright, have a good rest of your day. Ah, shit, fuck. Fucking shit's fucking... Ah, my fucking windows, man. Ah, shit. Ah, uh, it's all fucked up right here. Ah, shit. Ah, fuck. Fucking serious. Fuck. Now you gotta take this back to the fucking bar. Fuck. Good thing I got a few other fucking buses and bugs. Oh, just one bug. Ah. Now this thing's all fucked up. Damn, it's gonna take a lot of body work to get that fucking bag. Ah, shit. Just getting ready to look close like my fucking uh, other vans I used to own. Shit. Fuck. I think that was the car and they just sprayed it black. Are you fucking serious? I believe that was the fucking car. Fuck. Park this one up, I guess. Fuck. Yeah, alright. Let's get on out of here. Fuck. What's going on, man? Hey, what's going on, man? Nothing much. Not oh, really. What's going on with you? Nice day, right? Step out of the car. Step uh, out of the car. I don't, I don't care. Just get out. Why? What's going on, man? Get out the fucking car. Do you have money? Whoa, whoa. No, I don't got no money on me, man. Get out. I, I don't know, man. Get out of the car. Get out of the car now. No, I, okay. no man. Get out right now. I don't care. Get out. Do you have money? No, man. I ain't got no money. <laughs> oh shit, fuck. It was fucking scary. Oh shit. Later that night. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen. So we're gonna come back to the bar and we're gonna call it a day. I was gonna sleep in my van and I ain't gonna park somewhere, but fucking windows are all fucking destroyed. Fucking guy fucking hit me and then he robbed, tried to rob me earlier. Fucking bullshit. But yeah. Uh, this is where we're gonna call it. Go inside, smoke me some weed, me and call it a day. But yeah, it was just a little chillax video. My off day, man. So I figured, you know, let's go explore, see what's going on, especially since I saw that new gas station. Yeah, shit. Let's grab this fucking joint.
<laughs> yeah, but yeah, fucking. <laughs> yeah, just my updates, relaxing, relaxing, you know. So, yeah, other than that, uh, fucking, you know, I'm just back in my house. I was gonna stay in my van, as I said, but fucking. Fucking, some guy hit my van and. As I said, I wasn't planning on doing anything with Mickey Sticky Flowers, but I decided to hop in at the same the new gas station in my shop, you know. That's fucking cool and different. I've never seen something like that in uh, where, you know, flywheels usually is, but that's fucking cool. But yeah, other than that, it was just a little chillax day. It was my off day. I was going to open up the bar, but it's the holidays. Not too many people are in town. So, you know... Just ch chillaxing, you know? Plus, no one came to my fucking bar on Christmas Eve anyways, fucking humbug. But it is what it is. I'm, I'm over it. Because, fucking, I got more worry, more important things to worry about, you know? Than some fucking bar being open on Christmas Eve and me getting business. Yeah, that would've been good money, but that's fine. There's other ways I know how to fucking make money. And I'll just go back to my old ways if I got to, to help the bar. Baco Tuco, they got me some jobs that I could do. And I'm pretty sure that my brother Dickie will get involved too. He can't say he wouldn't because he fucking loves the money that they give us. It's good money. But yeah, other than that, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to call it quits here. As I say, chillax video. Not really me going to jail or getting too riled up with the cops. They basically helped Mickey. And Mickey's not always trying to do criminal stuff, you know. But, I mean, there's times when he gets caught up in the shit. But... Yeah, I was talking to Ricky earlier, and we're gonna try to get Ricky to fucking get on a shift with me and Dicky, so all three of us can work together. So hopefully we can get that done in uh, stone and written, you know, down in stone or whatever they say. You know, I'm a little fucked up right now, so I'm, my my memory's not thinking properly. Uh, sh fucking finishing up the ho ho hooey nanny. Yeah, but other than that, don't forget to like and. Subscribe and all that because if you like and comment and all that it helps my videos out with the statistics And if you subscribe it lets me know that you want to see my videos coming out whenever they come out And the likes let me know you like the video that you saw and the comment on there What you comment what you want whether you like the video or you didn't like the video I mean just comment. I mean I interact with you guys. I'm here to chillax and talk and have a good time You know fuck but yeah other than that See you all next time here at Firefly Gaming. Later. Fireflies in the sky.